Well guys, I've been mentioning that uh got a new project car. Well, time to show you what it is. Uh, it's a 1970 Oldsmobile Cutlass. This thing is a mess. So I'm gonna be walking through all the steps on redoing the motor, redoing uh, the body, the interior, everything. So let's go ahead and do a, do a once over on this. So a lot of things are missing, a lot of things. First off, motor. Motor's been plucked out of it. I have it, but they had a 455 in here. They uh, took the 350 out. So I have the old 350. They took the 455 back out of it. They kept that. Oh, uh, transmission's still in there. Wiring's a mess, as you can see. This thing's sandier than anything. I mean, Let's just hit on here. Uh, you can literally see the sand come out of this. But it's pretty strong. Uh, so it's sort of Michigan. You don't get a lot of uh, non-rusted out cars. So this is not too, too bad. Uh, let's do the walk around here. So here's the right front fender that the lady that I bought it from she said she uh, went to the ditch hit a small tree as we're walking around here see that had the vinyl top on it uh, top's been removed more of their own how-to uh, restoration here uh, all the moldings off but I have all of that they kept all of that Rear end's not too, too bad. It's got a lot of, you know, surface rust from the from sitting. But, I mean, everything's not too, too bad. Keep going all the way around here. I mean, it's not terrible. Could have been worse. So, let's go ahead and pop the door open with these non-door handles. So, carpet's been removed. I actually removed the carpet, I'm trying to see how bad the floor pans are. And, oh, it smells like rats and mice feces in here. But, I cleaned up the floorboard a little bit. You can see, uh, we got some holes. So, that's going to have to all be replaced as time goes. Um, got the door trims. Uh, got the door trim panels in the back here, where they took them off. I was told that the interior was redone at some point, so hopefully I won't have to do that again. It's got that awesome green color, uh, so that pretty much means we're going back green with it. But, I mean, honestly, I think everything should be here for the most part. I'll have to buy a lot of things here, so let's go ahead and take a look in the trunk. Now that I got my key for the trunk, Nice long screwdriver. We're going to pop this open here. I can do this on camera here. Ooh, I'm good. In the trunk, lots of parts. Lots and lots of parts. Some of it might not even be for this car, but I took everything that she had in the garage. So, we're going to go through. We're going to be redoing the whole entire engine everything we're gonna take the crank out new bearings clean her up and we're gonna go ahead and do everything we need to do to get this thing looking great it's gonna be a long process though probably about four years before getting it done but i'm very very happy with the good start that i have and uh yeah check out my other videos to start seeing me tear apart that engine and putting it back together